um, certainly uh, uh, the Nixon years a lot. And uh, one of the things, you know, is there's not many pa- reporters at a good newspaper who have the kind of, you know, I, I, there's nothing special. I have, I have friends that I know. A lot, most of the good guys at the major papers have somebody. And when you're at that level where you're, you know, you're, you've got access and you're covering the Pentagon or the State Department or the White House, the last thing you want to do, I know this makes, sounds almost silly, the last thing you want to do is chase somebody else's story. You just don't want to do it. So when somebody has me bops along and writes a story that says something, the only thing the editor can do is ask one of the good reporters to do it. And what they want to do is figure out some way to get this out, you know, turf this, get this off their desk. So it doesn't really get happened. It doesn't happen with the papers. And I understand it because I'm sure I did the same thing. We're all, you know, we all love what we do and we're more interested in ourselves than anybody else. That's one of the things about my business that's sort of wacky. Al Capone owed $150,000 in back taxes to the IRS, and he went to prison. Al Sharpton, he owes $4.5 million, and he goes to dinner at the White House. Brain force is here. Ladies and gentlemen, I've been on this the last few months. You probably noticed I've been more crazed, more focused, less brain fog, more energy, more special reports, and it's because of brain force. One of the worst things with most energy products is it's not sustainable, right? You're going to crash and going to feel really bad afterwards. This has a bunch of different antioxidants and compounds and polyphenols. Everybody's on these drugs to knock their brain out because the brain's so fried. We kept changing this formula over and over and over again until it became sort of a grand puzzle. For example, the L-theanine inside of it, that is activated by the different compounds in the yerba mate that we put inside of it as well. This just increases the compounds you already have. This is what you're actually designed to run on. Exactly. It's kind of like a car will run on one form of junkie gas, but it runs really good on what it's designed for. You will find Brain Force, Survival Shield X2, and other game-changing products at InfoWarsLife.com. Or call 888-253-3139. Introducing Secret 12, the new InfoWars Life vitamin B12 formulation. Most forms of vitamin B12 are highly processed and synthetic and could not be properly absorbed by the body. That's why for real results, so many are having to turn to painful B12 injections, which are known to have higher absorption rates. Now, InfoWarsLife.com is excited to announce that we can bring you our most bioactive, powerful form of B12 that has been developed with our exclusive perfected process. Secret 12 is a binary of nutramedical grade bioavailable coenzyme forms of B12, methylcobalamin, the same kind used in B12 injections, and adenosyl cobalamin. Secret 12 is simply taken by mouth, right on the tongue, and then swallowed. No needles, no injections. Don't take my word for it. Try it for yourself. Discover the secret. Secret 12. Secure your revolutionary Secret 12 formula right now at InfoWarsLife.com or call 888-253-3139. We're going to end our show tonight and pretty much end the year on this, a slate of Alex Jones rants. That's what Alex is known for. He's world famous, uh, or some people would say infamous for all the things that he says and does, the freakouts that he has right here at the desk that I'm sitting at right now. So here's a small selection of the best rants from 2015. In 1776, had been in three guerrilla wars. That's another reason the British were in big trouble. Oh, they thought some of their soldiers had maybe been in one war? Had such a high turnover rate? We're about to find people that in three wars? In the space of 15 years? So, I mean, I'm nobody. I mean, our forebears would be running around killing people right now. Okay? They wouldn't be usurped. They wouldn't be enslaved. They wouldn't be run over by a bunch of slick-talking underwoods. They'd strangle them. And not because they weren't as manipulative as Underwood, but because they were honorable and they were men who could do things out in the open and who had people follow them because they were strong and virtuous, not piles of manipulative lying crap. I mean, I know. I've read the books written by Edward Bernays. I've read the papers written by the founder of the Olympic Committee. 
I have read the statements by Hitler on sports. I know it's to manipulate men where men sit around in fantasy football. I mean, you might as well game the stock market. You might as well have fun. Uh, but it's just these aren't men. These aren't men. These are the type of men who will go work their arms out all day so they think they're big, who will just do the symbol of being manly and will say something smart to you or try to intimidate you. And the minute you turn to them and go, let's go right now. Just, just touch me and I'm going to break your neck. They go, whoa, dude. I'm like, wait a minute. I thought you wanted to act tough, man. I thought you wanted to kill me. I thought you were strong. No, you're not a man. You're the fake image of one. You don't build anything. You're not even alive. Your women and children don't belong to you. They belong to the globalists who conquered you. I don't want to be conquered. I don't want to have my destiny controlled. I don't want my children brainwashed. I don't want to be a slave and that humanity's done and we're being phased out. No! That's what doctors, we have this report coming up. Joe Biggs interviewed the mother. Does your mommy make you wear that dress? Do you want to wear that dress? How creepy. The government, through private agencies, you go pay asking weird, creepy sexual questions about mommy and daddy to your kids. What a freak show country we are. And this is worldwide. From Australia to Germany, this is being done. They banned in Germany new construction of single-parent dwellings or, or, or single-family dwellings because it's hateful to have a family alone. You need to be in the community house. <laughs> I mean, you're, see, those of us that have read history or read dystopic novels, we know, God, this is like textbook hell. But see, the young don't know. They come home to their parents and go, I'm not a boy. I'm not a girl. I'm a purple penguin. All designed to go, I'm a purple, I'm a purple, I'm a purple penguin, purple penguin, purple penguin. Oregon allowing 15-year-olds to get state-subsidized sex change operations. And you're going to pay for it. And you're going to pay for abortions through Obamacare. Because this is the freedom while foreign banks loot your pension funds and they prepare paramilitary forces and replace the military with robots and prepare Homeland Security in their own documents to take on gun owners, veterans, and the, and, and the South in some new civil war. That's in all the public documents. And then we go, hey, Jade Helms should be watched. Shut up, racist. And then I tried to go renegotiate and get new insurance. And they go, sorry. You have to wait till September. So it's now September. That's when open enrollment happens. So I can try to go find something cheaper. I mean, I used to just call up whoever I wanted and get rates. And, and no, it's all gone now. Thanks a lot for screwing everyone over. And then Gruber sits there and laughs and says how dumb we are and how it is a big screw job. Ha, 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 ha. And you people stick stickers on your car about what a great deal it is. You people are part of a schmuck cult, a idiot cult, where you celebrate being used, where you celebrate being morons, where you celebrate being screwed, where you celebrate being fooled, and dragging all the rest of us along with you to hell. The enemy's operation is so huge, so vicious, so evil, so stealthy, but also so overt that it boggles the mind as we are inserted into the beginnings of a false reality designed to make the act of resistance or free thought laughable, impossible. To quote Bertrand Russell, the population will soon be so conditioned, so drugged, so brainwashed that a rebellion by the proletariat would be as unthinkable as sheep rebelling against the practice of eating mutton. Mutton is sheep. A rebellion by the grassroots would be as unthinkable as sheep rebelling against being slaughtered. Sheep can't rebel. They're sheep. They submit. They fall. Will you fall? They think you will fall as they perch on our chest, smothering us, strangling us in the night. Or will we become aware of the attack and surge with the power that God gave us to resist? The 
enemy has sought to strangle us in our crib before we fully developed, knowing that we will tower above these disease twisted souls. They believe that their day of doom is here for humanity. But I tell the New World Order and the Rockefellers and the Rothschilds and the Sex Coburg Gothas and the Sods and all the rest of them, your day of doom is coming and you know it. And your devil cult will fall forever. Your next fall is forever. You won't rise from the ashes this time. This is happening. This is planned out. All this stuff's going to happen. We're here trying to hold it back, and people are complaining, going, hadn't gotten really horrible yet. What's your problem? Meanwhile, it is getting horrible. We're trying to hold the gate up while arrows are shooting over and rocks are being thrown on us, and we're battling as hard as we can. There's all these slack jog folks going, there's no crisis. So what if 100 million people are on welfare, 50 million on food stamps? So what if there's two quadrillion in derivatives? So what if we're having a war with Russia? So what if we're funding al-Qaeda? So what if they're opening the borders up and ignoring the law? So what if they shut off our power plants? So what if they carry all this out? I don't care. Why don't you quit being so alarmist all day long? Okay, scum, don't come to me when it all calls. Oh, you already are coming to me. You want government guaranteed tuition. You want more welfare. You want more corporate welfare. You love the system because you've never done anything. I'm here to take on the communist, to take on ISIS, to take on the New World Order. I'm here. And, and listen, I'm here to show you what the people can do. We're fighting a bunch of vipers and trash, and they can't trump the ace of spades, and that's the truth. Don't let anybody see it. You've got the head of the board that's political saying, don't let the public see this. And you got the guy that actually runs the FCC saying, here it is. It's secret with red tape. I know what's in it. It's really bad, but I'm not allowed to tell you. Well, we've had Senator Graham and Congressman Jones and others that have seen the 28 pages of the 9-11 report that's secret. And it just says our government stood down because Saudi Arabia was quarterbacking 9-11. See, inside job. Government knew, government stood down. I'm correct, I'm vindicated. Where are the apologies? Where, where are they? <laughs> Fight, have a fighting spirit, I know you do. But I'm saying others that haven't gotten involved. It's not. When you're lethargic in the info war, it feels like it's terrible. But once you actually get in the cockpit, once you get in a gun pod and start blasting enemy forces in the info war and watch them blow up and then watch them counter strike, then you're in the war. Then you can't get out. Then you're addicted. Then you're free. Then it all starts to fall into line. Now you're really alive. Now victory is within grasp. <laughs> yeah. The fighting spirit. This the is liberty. The rising. Rising! And that's it for our show tonight. Be sure to go to prisonplanet.tv and get yourself a free trial. You can see the nightly news, the special reports, the rants, all right there at prisonplanet.tv. Also, go to the Alex Jones channel on YouTube and keep up with all the great reports. I'm Jakari Jackson from the InfoWars Command Center, and we'll see you again tomorrow night. Knockout is back. If you want a product that has 10 known ingredients that naturally get your body to relax, your brain to relax, so you get deep, restful sleep, knockouts it. InfoWarsLife.com. L-theanine, hops flower extract, lemon balm extract, valerian root extract, chamomile flower extract, L-tryptophan extract, melatonin, and more. All organic, all the natural sources. It's the same price as leading brands of melatonin that are three milligrams a piece. It has three milligram, the standard recommended dose for an adult. It's got the GABA. So it would probably cost $50 to take all this as separate pills. It's $19.95. You take one or two of these, and it just is really clean, restful sleep is what the reviews are. It's what I've experienced. And it just synergistically puts everything in there. InfoWarsLife.com. That's InfoWarsLife.com. Or call 888-253-3139. You are watching the InfoWars Nightly News, which airs 7 p.m. Central at InfoWarsNews.com. And your support is helping us defend liberty worldwide.